welcome to, I guess you call this what, a vlog? This is a vlog. Vlog, uh, some free games. Like, we, anything we think, we're just gonna give it. Mm -hmm. And this is what's gonna happen. It's gonna inspire one of you. It's gonna really give you that insight. But okay, great. I got an idea, and that's kind of how they run it. Hopefully you'll see us. It's not rocket science, but it right. takes work. Right. Yeah. I ain't a business, man. I'm a business, man. Now let me handle my business. It's Friday. Welcome back. Good to be in Friday. We uh, just finished a, a challenging week. Uh, <laughs> you see me, I had, to, I had to put on my freaking street clothes, man. You know what I mean? We had to take the gloves week. off, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Had to, had to fight. And what did Nipsey say? Um, nigga, it get dark in the den. The question it is, is with the lion, can you? With the sharks, with can, the you sharks swim? can you swim? With the sharks, can you swim? We were right by the ocean, and we ain't bring a life jacket. <laughs> man, I'm telling you. But you know, welcome back, man. I'm a business, comma man. I'm a business man. You know, as Navelle said, it's Friday. Casual Friday, I don't know, he don't ever get the memo. He be always trying to do the putty yeah, suits and stuff. Yeah, a couple meetings and stuff this morning. Had to, had to meet a couple people, so. Everybody knows Casual Friday. You just pull up in your casual gear. Like, we had some legal issues. I guess you call them legal issues, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. like just getting regulatory. Regulatory and legal. The legalities and re regulatory stuff. Mm -hmm. It's been testing. You know what I mean? It's been some testing testing stuff but um it's crazy because i mean for me it was like you know coming from the background i come from in business and it's like you know as difficult as this week was as like holy smokes you ready to pull your hero type shit as this week was the one thing that i, I could say is a win for me anyway was if it all went south i ain't going to prison you know what I mean? Like, if it all went south, man, I get to still go home and see my kids. Um, and, and that's, to me, that's that, that's that's really important. I could sleep good. Every night, I would be able to sleep good. Like, you know, it's like, you know, and like, you know that's, I mean? that's worth the convo. Like, like yeah, like, we was tested. Mm -hmm. We had a chance of this week of the business. You know, what we created, smooth meal prep, pretty much being going back to zero. Mm. You know, everything we built, all the work we put in, being done. But, like, even within that, you know, he wasn't tripping. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I wasn't tripping. Like, yeah. it wasn't no, like, fuck, man. Like, uh. but, you know, we, we built for that. Again, coming mm -hmm. from his background, what he mentioned, like, you know, there was times when I'm, I'm close, I'm close to him when the shit going on, and it's like, yo, life is on the line. I'm gonna see you in five. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, we've <laughs> had them combos before, like, yeah, yeah. and I'm on the way. Like, fuck, man. Like, yeah. damn, I really ain't gonna see this nigga. Yeah. But. Yeah. Yeah. Did those were the when when the shit got challenging then and in that world, it was like, yeah, it's real, real. Mm -hmm. But here, okay, yeah, it's challenging. But what's the worst happen? Niggas lose every like you lose your brand. You know what I'm saying? You lose your money. Mm -hmm. you, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. you, you know you you lose what you built. Mm -hmm. um, but but tomorrow you can, you can re re rebound. You can tomorrow, rebound. You don't get that. And that's the major yourself. point, man. Right. Is like, and that's what kind of you know keeps us in that stress free and then you know mm. leaves that anxiety is like yo that attitude of gratitude mm -hmm. to be thankful to be here right and, and in my shit. case like okay boom you know I, that, that wasn't my situation but at the same time like how i see shit is okay freak i'm gonna still live you know right. what i'm saying i still gonna, got my yeah, family yeah, yeah, it's the yeah. same shit are you gonna die yeah are we gonna die from from this going to zero no so okay cool we roll through we figure it out but you know me stressing it and, and pulling my hair and and you know really feeling that 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 pain is like nah man because tomorrow if this goes so mm -hmm. i still got my skills with him right you know right, what i'm saying right, i still right, got right, these right. learning these learning lessons and i, I can go do it i'm gonna go there. build something else over here yeah. you know so it's like you know always being in that mind frame that, that attitude of gratitude really you know helps relieve that anxiety helps relieve that fear that stress and a lot of people and we were having this combo earlier like that, that competency you know, right. A lot of people in this situation probably would have folded. Right. Like, man, no, right. I have this. It's too much. You know, it's too much stress. It's too many calls. It's too many, you know, um, just not unforeseen. Yeah, yeah, unforeseen yeah, the future. Yeah, yeah. Like, I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. You know, it's not, it's not for everyone, for Real sure. And, and the capacity, everyone. like, you know, having the capacity and competency to be able to, like, to get through it. Because, mm -hmm. like, you know, and, I, and I'm going to be 100% honest with you, like, you know, 
um, based off of the challenge that were presented, um, by myself, I probably wouldn't have been able to make mm -hmm. it through. Mm -hmm. Not not because I didn't have the like the the I guess guts to, or mm -hmm. I didn't have like the will to. I just probably necessarily didn't have the skills. You know what I mean? Like so, like like I know my strengths. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And and, and this is the, the power of having a good team too, um, or whatever. Is because you can kind of feed off of each other's strengths. But like the reality of it is like you know, together we have way more capacity. Mm -hmm than we would individually, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And I mean, I, I probably could have figured it out, like I would have been able to, like I like to believe, like, you know, money solves a lot of problems, mm -hmm. so like, if I don't know how to do it, I maybe could bring someone in, you know, I might lose some money because I got to bring someone in to kind of help me deal with it, mm -hmm. but, you know, having people on your team that could kind of, you just tap in right away and we can just get it done, mm -hmm. I think that's really important. Yeah, yeah. Um, but the reality, like, you know, like, um, in, in business, man, like, you, you're going to, <clears throat> you're gonna go through some stuff. It ain't always gonna go perfect. Like when you're dealing with people and customers and government and, and all that different, it's a lot of moving parts. So things are gonna go off the rails. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You mm -hmm. could have it planned out to a T and things are gonna go off the rails because so and so woke up today and they, whatever they got going on in their life and mm -hmm. they just feel like, let me go do this. Mm -hmm. Let me go look into this. Let me go ask this. And all these things are so. You run into those circumstances and situations. So when things go wrong, like you know, Navelle talked about being built for, like being built for. It. Mm -hmm. Can you with the sharks? Can you swim? Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like like and so, the reality of it is like, it's it's, it's swim or drown. Sure. You know what I mean? And, sure. and 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 I mean, like I said, the brand was tested. So. Um, you know, had we not been able to kind of like weather this storm, like you know, it could have woke up and like the brand name be ruined, mm -hmm. or 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 we had to kind of just move into the whole yeah. like right, everything we built, yeah. right? And so, um, and not necessarily because of nothing on our end. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It wouldn't have been like we looked at who to blame. It would have been like, who, who do we blame? Yeah. These are just the rules of the game, yeah. and so we got to play them. Yeah. We got to play them, and, and, and to tie to tie back into the. You know, shit happens in life. Shit happens in business. Right. You know, so being able to, you yeah, gotta be able to withstand big. that mm -hmm. um, for sure. And then, you know, to tie back to that part of team, having a team, you know, builds capacity because you know, me and him together is more powerful than just me. Right. Again, you mentioned that my skills and his his skills combined just just covers more ground than just right. my skills or just his skills alone. Right. The other fact of it, like that, that played a huge role this week, is a responsibility. Mm. You know, and we talked about this earlier, you know, we have a team, it's, 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 we're relying on a lot of people, a lot of people are relying on each other, so if it was just me by myself, not only would I not have the capacity to do it all, I also wouldn't, uh, I didn't owe it to no one. I could walk away. You know what I'm saying? So the shit hits the fan, like, man, F this, it's too much work. Mm. But nah, like, I got, he relying on me to do it, because, mm -hmm. you know, my mom relying on, we got five employees who, if we said tomorrow that we not... Operate. operate no more they can't feed their families yeah. you know what i'm saying so it's like it's a lot you know having that team is, is real important your responsibility you know, when it comes and, to that for sure and, and, and sometimes too you know that responsibility is like some people own it mm -hmm. some people will take that responsibility and own it and some people will mm -hmm. take it and, and run from it mm -hmm. you feel what i'm saying and so like when you own a business like when you're the owner of the business, you are responsible for the business. Mm -hmm. Simple, and and that, and that's the thing too that people got to kind of question themselves before they make that decision. Do I want to be a business owner? Like, cause it looks good. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, do you want to own a business? Do you want to own that responsibility? Can you handle that responsibility? Yeah. I you know think you mean? should give more energy to that piece you mentioned. Of you know, some people run from the responsibility, some people thrive. Right. You know, cause right. for, for us, for me, my automatic mind was like, yo, he's counting on me, so I gotta. That's, right. That responsibility is a positive. It's giving right. me more. Right. You know, it's making it's making me do more of myself. But on the flip end, you know, someone, fuck man, um, all these people I'm relying on me, it, it becomes a pressure. It right. It becomes right. an added. It's a negative. I think you know that I think it's a reflection of you as a person. You know what I mean? I think that like business is gonna like tough times is gonna kind of like expose your character, whether they be good or bad. You feel what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. if you if you a bad character mm -hmm. and you run into some tough times, it's gonna expose it. You're gonna sure. you're gonna you're gonna see what type of a fuckhead that boy sure. is. You know what I mean? If you if you if you got good quality characteristics 
and you run into some tough situations, it's going to expose them. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be like, you got, that's all you got to lean on, your reflections. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, and so I think that, like, in, in business, really, you talked about, like, life going to throw shit at your business. Gonna, man, business is just an extension of life. Sure. And I mean, that's when you hear, like, you know, all the greats talk about, like, find your purpose mm -hmm. and all these things. Like, they're talking about, like, life things, mm -hmm. and then you add it to business. Mm -hmm. Your business is to service your life. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like your life shouldn't service your business. Mm -hmm. Your business is to service your life, mm -hmm. to, to, to be able to do the things for your life that yeah. you would want to do. Yeah. So like your principles are going to show, like your purpose is going to show if it's a real purpose or if it's just some flaky yeah. shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like if it's just some flaky shit, you're probably going to dip right away. Yeah, sure. and, and so I think like with that being said, because I know who we're talking to, like because of some people that are like, you know, I, I don't want to use this conversation to scare people from entering into business. Mm -hmm. I want to use this conversation so that people know why they're entering into business mm -hmm. and then prepare their mind to really do this. Because you know what? Listen, this has been the best six months of my life. Trust me. I ain't a businessman. I'm a business, man. Now let me handle my business.